Hello and welcome to Moo Moo Math, where we upload a new math video every day. In this video, I'd like to talk about the divisibility rules. And learning the divisibility rules just helps you go ahead and it increases your number sense, which in the long run will help uh, make math a little bit easier and it's really helpful with fractions. It just uh, helps you a better math student. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's begin with, and I'm going to cover up these so we don't get ahead of ourselves. Um, a number is divisible by 2 if it ends in a 0, 2, 4, 6, or even an 8. In other words, all even numbers. For example, 356, notice that it ends in 6, so it will be divisible by 2. A number is divisible by 3 if the sum of its digits is divisible by 3. So 516, that's 5 plus 1, plus 6 is equal to 12, and 12 is divisible by 3. Next, let's look at 4. It's divisible by 4 if the last two digits are divisible by 4. In this example, the last two digits are 32. And yes, 32 is divisible by 4 because it uh, goes in 8 times. Next, 5 is pretty easy. If it ends in 0 or 5, it's divisible by 5. 6 is, it must be divisible by 2 and 3 to be divisible by 6. So look at 702. We know it's divisible by 2 because of the 2 there. And then 7 plus 2 is 9, and that's divisible by 3. Okay. Next, a number is divisible by 9 if you, uh, if you add the digits, and that is divisible by 9. So for instance, 297. 2 plus 9 is 11, plus 7 is 18. 18 is divisible by 9. And the last one, 10, is very easy if it ends in 0. Now, so let's now. just... Visibility rules in the long run can save you a lot of time. It will help you become a better math student, and you can impress your friends. Thanks for watching. Moo Moo Math uploads a new math video every day. Please subscribe or share.